All right, we're gonna move on. We're gonna move through. Thanks, Sean. Appreciate you. We're gonna move through. Yeah, yeah. Hit that like button. He says, "All right, this is gonna be a long video because he talks a lot." <laughs> but we're gonna come over here, Jopo. We have these in the shop now. These are actually pretty cool. These are one of the newer interchangeables that everybody uh, seems to really like compared to some of the other ones. In my opinion, I have to try to be unbiased, but I do think I like these locking mechanisms a little bit better than most of the other ones. They're very sturdy, very strong. So the only issue I've ever seen with these is when you deal with the outer sleeve here, like you see, this is a lot like a, a switch grip. Uh, it just, it's my, maybe, uh, I don't even know how much smaller it is, but it's such a small number smaller than like what a switch grip is. So in a inch and a half hole, it's just a little bit smaller. I think the newer ones have been better. I haven't had an issue with these staying like getting in tighter like I have in the past. So I think they did something to fix that. So that's good. So they actually do stay in a little bit better for me. I've had no issues installing those over the last, I don't know, year or so. So they seem to be good. I've had no complaints out of any of these so far. So we're moving on pretty good with these. So now we have Jopos in the shop. We have Switch Grip. We've got the Vice Its. The only one we don't have in there is the Ultimate. And I know another company is coming out with a new one. I can't let you know about that yet, but somebody's doing something new. Uh, at least they say they are. I don't know if they really are or not, but we'll find out soon. So there's your Jopos. People love them. I like them. I don't use them yet. I might. Who knows? We'll try them. Moving on. All right, we got the Vice vice booth over here this is where you get all your pro shop stuff for the most part a lot of the pro shop stuff we have one of these guys these guys are amazing every time you do plug work just throw it in there it'll clean it up for you you don't have to do anything that's pretty sweet but so they do all of the a lot of the fitting stuff the dams everything over here i know jayhawk actually just came out with some new pitch gauges which is pretty neat uh, oh yeah speaking of cleaners and stuff here we go we got ctd the men in action over here with your true cut pads. Got all kinds of different stuff with the polish here. You got the amp for bowling balls, right? This, I was excited to see that. I didn't know they made these. That's for putting on your uh, on your hands so your hands don't get all messy and nasty. These are the new backpacks. Backpacks are pretty sweet. All of your different cleaners, the purple stuff, that wow factor. Uh, this actually, he says, replaces all these. If you just use this, you're in good shape. That's what I have at the shop. Life after death, it's pretty sweet. It restores the tackiness. Another green wall factor. You got the clear, which will bring back the performance of your bowling balls when you use that and your different chamois pads. We're gonna, we're gonna demonstrate these. These are, this one's my favorite, the CTD power pad. That one's my favorite because of the backing. If you look at the backing of it, it's not like a, it's a texture but it's not like sticky or anything. It doesn't have, it doesn't stick to your hand. It's hard to explain, but some of the, uh, some of the other towels that I've used have had some weird, like sticky stuff to it. And that one doesn't, so I like that. Where'd the scanner go? Uh oh, I don't have a scanner here. Surface scanner, oh, he's got it hiding. It's back there. So the surface scanner is one of the coolest things, I think, and they just did an update to it. So now with the scanner, you actually can narrow down your numbers a little bit. Before it would tell you like, you know, between a thousand and two thousand, or it would just give you one single number. Now they've narrowed it down to where it will tell you a whole lot more. You guys have seen me use this a little bit already, but we'll give you a little bit quick look here. See, each time he pushes the number, 6,500. That makes sense because it's just a, it's a clear plastic ball, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, it narrows it down, gives you a little bit more increments in the actual viewing of what the surface is. So that's really cool. So if you've got one of these, make sure to do the update so that way you get those better increments on that. If you don't have one, I'm gonna send you a link and I'm gonna show you exactly where to get one of those here soon. Uh, this is Dustin, by the way. He's your basic brand manager, right? What's that? You, what, how, what's your title here? Staff coordinator. Staff coordinator. So he handles all the cool people because he's the coolest people. <laughs> so the Absolutely. coolest people handle the cool people. Absolutely. So we appreciate you. Hey, We're gonna show you. you off a little bit. Thank We're you. gonna move on here. Let's go, what do we got? We got KR, KR bags. Bags and shoes and stuff, we got all kinds of stuff. People love KR, they got all kinds of stuff in here. 
Actually, we're at 25 minutes. This is going to be a long video, folks. Let's see what we got over here for the new chamois and stuff. We keep these in stock all the time. We love these chamois. These chamois are really, really nice. And for the price point, they're actually pretty cool, too. So all the different colors I love. Like I like that Lucky Charm one, the Strike Force with the Lucky Charm there. That's pretty sweet. We keep that one in stock. They make the Avalon pads and everything. The True Cuts over at CTD. Obviously, I prefer the True Cuts over anything right now. Some of the new shoes coming out over here. Pretty sweet. Different ones, you can see. They're definitely trying to be different. You can see KR came out with their own type of BOA type system. They've got a whole BOA system for their own, which is pretty neat. I'm not sure what they call it. I don't remember. What do they call it? What do they call it? What do they call it? Hey, what do you guys call the... Anybody know what they call the BOA system for KR? What, what, what do you call this one? KR Fast Twist. It's the Fast Twist. Okay, I know you didn't call it BOA, so I wasn't sure what it actually was called. Fast Twist. Okay, so that is the Fast Twist, folks. It's not a BOA system. It is a Fast Twist. And here's... We got some gloves. All the same stuff. That's been around for a while. You can see all the shoes here. Basically the same thing as what we already have in stock. Shoe covers and everything, so not a lot of new here, but pretty cool. They did bring on AJ Johnson for all you bowling center owners. If you want to get some shoes there, you get yourself some rental shoes, that's pretty neat. Moving on, let's keep going this way. We're gonna come on down yonder, let's walk through here, walk through here, walk through here. We've got uh, Cecil, anything new from Vice? What do we got? Anything cool? Yeah, so we got a new tool set up here. That is pretty neat. So now what you have is an insertion tool with the, instead of the screwdriver, it actually now will only allow it to go a certain depth. Ah, there you go. So okay. by doing that, it's going to take a lot of stress off of the system. Yeah. Also, yeah, yeah. I'll, we I'll have our own right hammers. All right. So now this hammer is significantly lighter. So by doing that, they can't beat the You're not, you're not going to blast it, it out of there, there. right? Makes sense. Then this I, just hangs on the wall for the pro shops to organize it. I need that. That's pretty sweet. I like I like the new handle deal. That's pretty neat. Those are cool. Yeah. Definitely different. Very nice. Still all the same tapes. Any new tapes are all the same. Same tapes. Same tapes. Uh, cool. We do have uh, our sanding pads that you I think you've seen before. Okay. We got new sanding pads over here. The Vice came out with their own Aberlon type of pad. Is so, it an Aberlon? It is not. It is actually our own pad that we have developed. Oh, Aberlon's just a name, then. It's not a type Aberlon of pad. Aberlon is a manufacturer. It's a manufacturer. Yes. I got you. Okay. We actually have developed our own sanding pads. Okay. And the pad actually stands for precision abrasion discs. Okay. So, and these, what we've done, we've actually tested them with a surface scanner. So now these are truer to the number when you use them. Yeah, because we've definitely noticed that you use a 500 pad, sometimes it doesn't come out at 500. Right? Correct. Yeah. So. And so these will come out right at 500. Okay. It'll last about four to five times longer than an Avalon pad. How long do you think an Avalon pad normally lasts? They'll last six to ten balls, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. If that, it, it, they'll they'll start degrading pretty much instantly. So you, so you think you'll get you know 20, 30 balls out of this? Uh, yes, absolutely. Okay. We've already seen it. Okay, good. The other thing, what we've done is we've changed the foam. The foam is a denser foam, so it's not as mush as soft. Okay. By doing that, we've also allowed it by getting denser, it doesn't absorb the water. So now, with it not absorbing the water, it doesn't degrade the material from the backside. Right. So now these stay drier longer. Also, this material here, as you use it, it gets clogged up. Well, now you can spray it with the water and it'll wash right off. Nice. There you go. Cool. Put them back in the bag. Now you don't get your bag all wet. Now, I know y'all don't like to do this, but how do you compare them to like a true cut pad where they say theirs doesn't clog up as well? To be perfectly honest with you, I have not tested them against a true cut pad. Okay. So I will, I can't comment on that because right. I haven't. I, but either I, way, if they both are able to get rid of that clogging, that's obviously a good correct. thing. That's a very good thing. Correct. And that's what helps them last longer. Absolutely. Right? So, um, And like I said, it doesn't get the water in, the, so it doesn't get this so soaking wet. Right. And then it doesn't start degrading it from the backside of right, the paper. Right, right. And then also they come pre-done. They're ready to hang you up can, for retail sale. And you can put done. it right back in the bag, like you said. So yep. you don't even have to. Okay, that's cool. Correct. Right on. Cool. They got t-shirts. New colors on the chamois. New color chamois. We've got uh, orange, purple, yellow, pink. But yeah, one of the other things we got now we got one ball rollers. One ball rollers. And then you can add the add-on bag to it to make it two balls. Yep. So now you have a nice compact thing for. What's uh, what's that retail for? You say? Uh, that I do not know. Not sure. 
Well, okay. it's going to depend on the pro shop. Well, of obviously. course, right. Um, but yeah, so, so it's going to be way more expensive at my shop because I don't give stuff away. Correct, exactly. <laughs> yeah, because you're running a business. Uh, but yeah, then we have one more item over here that uh, over around the corner. All right, let's yeah, go around the corner. Let's check it out. Oh, it's this way. Let's go. Let's go see what he's got. I like new stuff. New stuff is fun. This is Cecil, by the way. Those of you that don't know Cecil, he's been around Vice for a long, long time. Oh, we've got a new kinesiology tape. Yes, it Sweet. is our K plus tape. K plus, okay. It is infused with menthol and tourmaline. All right. So now when you put it on, you'll start to feel the menthol within about 15 minutes. Start yep. to just like just we just put icy hot on it. Yep. But now you get the the resistance from the uh, kinesio tape to help keep it stable and then you'll get the menthol getting into it and working and getting it warm yeah yeah so yeah did uh didn't storm do something like that um they or have, they or they have different metals in there right different they have the in metals where in i theirs. think genesis uses the copper right they're using a different metal we're actually using menthol in the corner yeah so i haven't seen i haven't seen menthol yet so that no, is new is that's pretty cool new, yeah that's pretty cool. So yeah, so you got, are these the only two colors you do right now? I uh, also have black. Yeah, black. Yeah. This is like a, a gray, whitish. White yeah, it's white, pink, and, and black. Pink. Sweet. Cool. So those are the newest things from uh, from Vice. Thank you, Cecil. Appreciate you. Got, got these triples here. we got one more here. Well, actually, I got two more things to show you. Two more things. Yeah. So now we have our regular three ball rollers, our toe rollers. Now we put them in a tournament roller. So now they actually have a base, a larger wheel, and a telescoping handle. Do those make it on an airplane? They will be a little over 50 pounds. That's our that's, problem. That's the only problem. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But it's because Genesis has a new one too. That's the same thing. They put the bigger wheels, and they're like, ah, it doesn't quite make it. Yeah. Now, Dang if you're it. if you're like me and travel for a living, you can get the 60 pounds. You get it no problem. Yeah, but, no problem. But yeah. yeah, the 50 pound. This will be about five pounds over with 15 pound bowling balls. Right. Um, but if but you don't travel a lot, the better wheel base is definitely correct. worth it. Now the other thing is, is our add-on bag for our three-ball toe roller will also connect to this in the exact same manner. Oh, so, so you can make you, it a four-ball bag. So if you have a, well, you can put that on top. But our shoe bag that goes on our three-ball toe rollers will actually attach to this as well. So now you see our add-on shoe bag that yep. connects right to it, just like our three-ball toe roller. Yep, that's pretty cool. There you go. So that's definitely a less expensive version of, you know, a bigger, sturdier bag. Correct. Bigger, and sturdier three-ball roller. up on its own. Yep. So that's another That's plug. a big thing for tournament-type bags. Yep, Those absolutely. other little ones don't stay on their own. That's right. pretty bad. And then the handle telescopes in and out. So. And I bet nice you and that one won't tip over nearly as much as what a tournament <laughs> bag does. Correct. Right. So that's pretty sweet. That's pretty cool. All right, you say you got one more thing? What do you got? So this is more for the pro shops. Yep. So if you have the tube system or the racks where you're having to drop the grips in, yep. well, now we have these in a five pack that are already preloaded. Okay. So now if you need to get, now you see I need five more, you're done. Well, yeah. Yeah. I've no, I've, I've been, I've had a few of these in shops before without the, the dividers there yep. and they become a mess. Like yeah, even, so, and then getting it to shut sometimes can be a pain in the butt. Right. Yeah. And also, if you've got multiple sizes like we have here, yeah, there you then go. you now have them divided and separated up. Okay. Now we're going to say this is a full kit, same size. Okay. When you use this front one, you just pull this out, slide these forward. Now it looks full again. Yeah. Now when you go to need pull your inventory to see how much you need to order, I need five. When you get them in, you just set it in place, you're done. Boom. It's that quick. Perfect. Yeah, because uh, like I've got the turbo system at mine where it's the tubes. Right. And dropping them in those tubes is such a pain in the butt sometimes. I'm yeah. not going to lie. Can't so lie. So that's pretty away. cool. Then our, our slugs are in six packs now, and they actually fit right in the system. That's pretty cool. That's pretty neat. Definitely going to have to look at that. So now they just pull right out. Yeah. You finish it up, you get your order in, you put it right back in place, you're done. Yeah, we support all companies, so we might actually bring one of these into our shop as well. So make life easier for Absolutely, sure. Absolutely, 100%. For sure. Okay, sweet. Cecil, right, appreciate Thanks, you. Man. Thanks. All right, guys, Moving be on. safe. They also have their cleaners and stuff. 35 minutes into this video, folks. Hope you're still around. But all right, got a couple more stops. Maybe I'll break this up a little bit for you. Who knows?